you a dancer? I am a dancer. <laughs> you are a good dancer. Your dance is absolutely beautiful. And the judges said that your partnership is also beautiful as well. So how would you say your partnership has grown over the past few weeks? And how would you describe your relationship now? I was thinking about this the other day and I was like, we've really got to like a really comfortable, like this week, we laughed a lot. I think I laughed a lot at your like facial expressions. <laughs> Do you remember that one day? So we had the team dance rehearsal and um, Trevor's like, getting really into the character and obviously that's what he does for a living so this is really that that bit like he like enjoys that he's really into it and i really enjoy it. when i look at him and i dance with him i have moments now of being super proud of what he's achieving and like seeing his body position and then seeing the commitment in his face and and i just like smile and he looks at me like what are you smiling at and i'm like i'm just Looking at you, like killing it. I'm just so proud. Well, when we were prepping the team dance, there was a lot of this stuff. There was a lot of this going on, and I was like, I love it. Keep it in there. Yeah, so. Um, but I think we just have a really easy way of communicating with each other. We naturally very, I don't know what is the word, just um, like, I don't supportive and yeah. supportive of each other and check, always checking in. You brought me ibuprofen today. Thanks so much. <laughs> you know, welcome. we just really connected that way. I'm a bit of a booer in the ballroom, it's notorious. I'm a, I'm a massive cheerer, but I'm a massive booer as well because, you know, it's TV and that's the name of the game and I like to support um, support my friends and my colleagues when they're um, sort of getting some, you know, remarks. And, uh, and so I very lightly booed, but she definitely called me out on it. And I was like, I'm so sorry. So yeah, so I was very sorry about that. There but are, there it's are, a protective side of me. There are other couples that when they get up here right before their dance, wait for Emma's. Yeah! Yeah, it, it literally goes twofold. More so, that, more so even the screaming. Like I will really scream and support. You can probably hear it. There's like one slightly more louder than everyone else person, and that's me. <laughs> and so on Tuesdays, my voice is completely gone. But yeah, I, I unfortunately I have that side of me that's a bit Larry and I also boo. <laughs> so sorry, Carrie Ann, but totally just, you know, I respect the hell out of her. She's amazing and I'm just I'm in love with the person she is. I think she's just a really awesome person. So it's not disrespectful to her at all. It feels amazing. It feels amazing. And like I was saying before, this this really was in my wheelhouse of freedom and stuff. And I feel like if I had more time to learn frame and some of those other dances and really hone that stuff, then I think I could get a lot better too. But um, I, all I know is I'm loving it. Been that way all week. Ever since I first heard the song, first started seeing what Emma had choreographed for us, it just, I don't know, it, it, it touched me. So I just tried to stay open to that. Um, I wasn't expecting to completely lose it um, when we went up to talk to Alfonso, but you know, I mean, that's also the other part of my job is, is my career is, is to be open and be vulnerable. So um, I'm, I'm actually just really pleasantly surprised that I was able to do that here.